Hey, what's up? Uh, just making a quick video. I've done this video before, or at least the topic of this video before. And, um, you know, it's something that's very important, and that's why I keep on making videos for you guys. Um, you know, I get a lot of people, like I, I mentioned in every uh, video that I, that I speak with uh, on a daily basis, um, you know, there are a lot of people hurting out there. There are a lot of people going through stuff. And, uh, you know, we, we always converse about things, you know. We uh, share ideas, we share... Uh, solutions and so on and so forth but here's my my uh, my other attempt at trying to drive this message uh, home you know I'm gonna give you an example of something okay so I put my hand over a stove and I burn myself uh, I grab a block of ice and it's too cold um, I put my wet hands on an outlet and I get electrocuted and so on and so forth. And the whole point of that, of those examples, is that there's a common denominator here. So you can look at all of these different things as problems. You know, man, I always get burned. Man, this always happens to me. Man, this always happens to me. But there's a common denominator in, within the whole thing, and that is you. You keep touching the fire and getting burned. You keep on picking up the ice and getting frostbitten. You keep putting the fork in the electrical outlet. Uh, you keep on putting your head underwater and almost drowning. Uh, you keep on jumping in the mud and thinking you're gonna go somewhere. It's like, at the end of the day, really, um, the responsibility of the trajectory of your life and where you want to take it ultimately ends up being with you. Now, I do understand that these things that I mentioned, uh, these props here in my example, um, you know, would can signify a family member, can signify a spouse, can signify a sibling, can signify a, uh, a work, um, you know, person, a boss or something. And, and it's not that easy to just kind of not touch them, not get in, in, in their realm, uh, not be in their sphere. So I understand that. But ultimately still, like the bottom line is, you know, it's your responsibility on, you know, how close you get to that fire, uh, how close you get to that block of ice, how close you get to that mud pile, how close you get to that electricity, and so on and so forth. You still have control over that. Now, while it seems extreme, it is a solution, and that is, uh, unfortunately, get rid of those things, and then this way you won't have to worry about gravitating towards them and getting burned and so on and so forth. So in this analogy, of course, you know, those things represent people, and sometimes those people, you know, come to you, but it's still your responsibility to not touch it so you don't get burned and that's the whole thing here the principle is that at the end of the day you do have some sort of control you have a lot of control over um, not getting burned all the time and and not falling into the same circumstances it's ultimately it's ultimately uh, your decision okay I wrote a book about it the superpower of decisions but you're ultimately responsible uh, for that and while like I said it's not easy um, nothing in life is easy and most certainly the things that are important are not going to be easy. So these are one of those things that uh, just is not easy but it's something that you need to be aware of or at least be cognitive of and understanding that you and I are part of the equation on why we keep you know getting burned uh, or keep being around certain people or keep you know falling into certain um, uh, pitfalls. And it's because we do have control to really kind of cut the cord and then, you know, hopefully we don't get burned by that particular person or by that situation. So listen, guys, uh, I, I make videos all the time about stuff that I've been through. Uh, a lot of the uh, videos that I make come through uh, conversations that I've had with people and continue to have with people that are hurting in some way, shape or form or another. And, uh, you know, having these these conversations with you hopefully gives you just a little bit of wisdom because i don't believe in reinventing the wheel 
and hopefully these little tiblets will help you not reinvent the wheel and go through some sort of calamity that uh, you don't need to go through unnecessarily. All right, so I'm looking forward to hearing from you guys. As always, feel free to uh, uh, reach out to me. Let me know what you think of the subject. All right, guys, peace.